Meg gasped as Andrew knocked out Duchess from being greeted at King Charles's coronation in a recent UK vote. Britons would rather see Prince Andrew attend the coronation of King Charles III than the Duchess of Sussex, new polling suggests. In an exclusive survey for the Independent, 43% of people thought the Duke of York should attend the historic service marking his brother's ascension to the throne. Meghan Markle was outraged, according to a source, after her secret royal boyfriend Prince Andrew embarrassed her. Meanwhile, King Charles has barred Meghan Markle from attending his coronation in case she steals the show and eclipses her father-in-law. Meghan, on the other hand, would undoubtedly use Archie to exact revenge on King Charles for failing to invite her kid and her to the coronation. Let's see how drama queen do. In particular, in the poll, the same proportion believed he should not attend, according to Savanta polling conducted just over a year after he reached a multi-million settlement in the sexual assault case brought against him by Virginia Roberts Jufrey. Meanwhile, just 40% of the 2,274 people surveyed thought Meghan should go to Saturday's historic ceremony, while 44% felt she should not. Following the lingering fallout from his memoir Spare, Prince Harry confirmed last month that he would attend the coronation alone, with Meghan staying home in the United States with their children Prince Archie and Princess Lilibet. The couple opted to step back as senior royals and leave Britain in 2020, just two years after their wedding. Even before that decision, Harry had condemned the abuse and harassment and racial undertones in the relentless British press coverage of the former suit sector. Prince Andrew was stripped of his military titles and royal patronages last January by the late Queen after he was accused by Ms. Jufrey of sexually assaulting her on three occasions when she was 17 and being trafficked by his late friend, the paedophile financier Jeffrey Epstein. The pair reached an out-of-court settlement two months later, in which Andrew accepted no liability, and he always rejected any claims of wrongdoing. But he faced further humiliation as York councillors voted last April to strip the 63-year-old of his freedom of the city title. While the Duke was permitted to play a significant role in the events marking his mother's death last September, he faced heckling from crowds during a procession of his mother's coffin along Edinburgh's Royal Mile. YouGov polling in April placed Andrew as the least popular royal in its regular surveys, with just 10% of respondents viewing him favorably. He was followed by Meghan and Harry, of whom 24 and 29% respectively had favorable views. In Savanta's new polling for the Independent, Britons were considerably more opposed to both Andrew and Meghan attending the coronation than the idea of inviting Sinn Féin, the party formerly known as the political wing of the IRA, which overtook Unionists for the first time in Northern Ireland's 2022 election. 32% of people felt Sinn Féin should attend, while 38% did not. Michelle O'Neill, vice president of the party which still refuses to take its seats in the House of Commons, has confirmed she will attend the Westminster Abbey ceremony. The strength of opposition to Andrew and Meghan's attendance was closer to that of a Chinese government representative going to the ceremony, to which 46% are opposed and just 30% are in favor. While senior conservatives have called the move outrageous and an insult to the freedom-loving people of former British colony Hong Kong, China's Vice President Han Zheng is expected to be present on Saturday. Moreover, readers from Cornwall to vote for their favorite member of the royal family and there was a clear winner, Princess Anne. The Princess Royal is frequently referred to be the most hard-working member of the royal family, as she attends the most important events. Kate Middleton, Princess of Wales and Duchess of Cornwall, came in second place. Meanwhile, Meghan is totally despised, behind Princess Anne, Princess Catherine, and Prince William by 5%, according to the naive Sussex squads in Cornwall. Many people across Cornwall loved seeing her during her first official visit as a Duchess in February of this year. During the trip, she bumped into her former history teacher, a reunion people found emotional. For decades King Charles was in charge of the Duchy of Cornwall, now Prince William is and he and his brother Prince Harry have spent a lot of time down here. The Prince Harry have sp
gasped as Andrew knocked out Duchess from being greeted at King Charles's coronation in a recent UK vote. Britons would rather see Prince Andrew attend the coronation of King Charles III than the Duchess of Sussex, new polling suggests. In an exclusive survey for the Independent, 43% of people thought the Duke of York should attend the historic service marking his brother's ascension to the throne. Meghan Markle was outraged, according to a source, after her secret royal 